if I could like put a log cabin in like, you know, a 1920s style like Hollywood bungalow together, I guess that would be my style. <laughs> I'm Khalees, and we're home. Actually, it's funny, I'm like, I never sit in these chairs. I'm like, <laughs> oh my god, it's a good angle like this, looking around from this vantage point. I never sit here. <laughs> I end up sitting over there more, I think. I don't know why. Maybe it's so I can look at the couch, I'm not sure. I'm extremely traditional. My house is probably more reflective of who I am than anything else. You know, whatever it is, like I feel like every, there should be like little vignettes all over the place of like who you are. I don't know if I have a thing for birds. I think I just like really dramatic creatures in general. So this happens to be one of them. I'm such a homebody, but I can be. You know, like I've put everything that I care about in this house, from my kids to my kitchen to my like dad's record collection to like, I literally have everything here. This is my happy place. Like minimal is just not my thing on any circumstance. Like not with anything, not with fashion, food, interior, like nothing, like more is more. Ta! <laughs> That's from my milkshake video back in 2000. This is 20 years of fashion, basically. I miss New York in, like, style. You'll spend the day in workout clothing here in LA and no one will bat an eyelash. I look in my closet and I'm like, oh, I'm never going to wear that ever, ever. I collect stuff from everywhere and it's been, like, over years. I got this mirror in, I want to say, where was I? It's either Thailand or Bali. So this lady, my singing lady, I've had her since I was 17. It was my first trip out of the country without my parents. Needless to say, also, my luggage is always really, really overweight. <laughs> like, always. They're like, what do you have in there? I'm like, nothing. <laughs> this is our den, kind of everything room. I guess the best part about it is this chandelier, because I made it. And so, like, I went to um, all these, like, pawn shops and collected all these brass instruments, and I figured, like, this is my, my band. <laughs> Me and my mom. And it was tiny. She was literally, like, 16 here, I think, or, like, 15. I don't know if this was, like, a quinceanera or something. I'm basically, like, a taller, younger version of my mom. So this is what made me buy the house first, to be honest. When you walk, it just feels so old Hollywood. Like it had this like, you know, like the two palm trees and then it just felt so dramatic and grand. My friends call this the compound because like once I'm here, I'm like, sorry guys, not leaving. They're like, she's, she's locked down. She's in the, she's in the compound. Those are pool toys. She's like, what do you mean? I can't see anything. <laughs> she looks ridiculous. <laughs> That's just lingering there till it gets down. <laughs> it's from my son's first birthday. He just had a birthday like two weeks ago. One of my ridiculous friends came over and was like, oh, that's the craziest party tray ever. And I was like, it's not a party tray. <laughs> I'm like, in another time with another everything maybe, but no. <laughs> I've got a pocket full.